Hello Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly general tarot reading for June and happy birthday to you Gemini. Um, I'd like to thank everybody who have been with me all this while. I've been away because I haven't been feeling too well as some of you may know but I feel a lot better now so I thought I'm just going to get on with it. And what I want to say is yes, I hope this um, year um, your birthday brings you all the best things that you have been hoping for and yes um, happy birthday again so we're going to start we've got our tarot deck here we've got our energy card deck here which it will be coming out soon I created that and so we are adding our oracle deck here as well so you've got more cards okay so we're going to see what the universe has for you gemini i've already pre-shuffled the deck so i won't shuffle for too long so let's see your main energy for june what is crossing or complementing you and your foundation your foundation okay and what's going to be on your mind and um influencing you yes and then what's going to be important that is coming for you to be aware of okay so let's see what it's going to be okay 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 remove this here a little bit that's it so everything fits in yeah okay so let's find out universe tell us I feel I should pick this one okay and then let's see what the descriptive energy deck has got for you So let's see the bottom of the deck. You've got the Knight of Wands upright. Okay, so your main energy, the magician, what is complementing or crossing you is the world. So the world is complementing you. Two major arcanas, yeah? So your foundation, let's see, is Seven of Pentacles upright. And let's see what's going to be on your mind. King of Pentacles upright. Okay, let's put this one here. Yes, I think. Yeah, I think that's good, isn't it? Okay, so um, influencing you is the Two of Pentacles reversed. And then something important coming, you know, for you to be aware of. So is the Seven of um, swords upright so you've got two sevens here and let's find out your message it says grounding gemini grounding oh yes so let's see it says security no, sorry sanctuary so yes sanctuary grounding grounding and sanctuary okay so Gemini, what I feel here is I want to um, talk about the bottom of the deck here. Well, what can I say or what isn't there to say? I feel that there is something coming up, okay? Some information coming up that you have been waiting for quite a long time. And this information that you get is going to make you feel very, very, very happy. I feel it's going to make you very, very happy because you've been working on a certain project for quite a while and you have been, you have been calculating and looking at everything that you can possibly look at. And I feel that, you know, information is going to come in that is going to help you um, move forward because I feel this is a bit of stagnation but 
you enjoy what you are doing. We've got your main energy being um, the magician here. So I feel that whatever um, you have been working on is coming to a fruition. Okay. And for some of you, if you have been stagnating, whatever you are working on is certainly going to come to pass for you. That is how I'm seeing it here. Okay. I'm seeing it that you are going to, it's coming to fruition for you. You are starting afresh. I feel good things are coming for you, you know, Gemini. That's all I, I feel here because upon reflection here, that what has influenced you, 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 you've been having a lot of things to deal with. Okay. Dealing with more than you could um, even imagine. So I feel you are going to let some things go. Some things that are not helping you are going to let you go. And, um, of course on your mind is money affairs, money affairs. I feel there's more to do with money rather than anything else. Okay. Because it's your project. This is all pentacles, pentacles, pentacles. Yeah. And I feel that for some of you, this could have something to do with your home, have something to do with your home. Because it says sanctuary. I feel whatever is coming for you, you're going to have um, a lot of peace of mind. That is how I'm seeing it. You're going to have peace of mind here. Yeah? But I feel, yeah. If you are hoping to buy a house, I feel there's going to be money in for you. However, I feel that um, with this serving of salts, I feel it's more of a warning. Okay, that whoever you are dealing with, however many people you are dealing with, whatever situation you are dealing with, I feel you need to be mindful so that um, you don't get trapped. Okay, because you've got two servants here. For some of you, it could even be you trying to be sneaky in certain deals, but I feel like you need to be mindful here. Okay. I feel for so, most of you, it, it, it has something to do with your home because you've got ground in here. You've got ground and you've got sanctuary here. So what I can say for you here is don't forget to, to ground yourself. And I feel that in whatever you do, I feel your home, your home, your home safety is what you're going to be thinking about the most. And I feel it has something to do with your home or a project to do with your home or a business to do with your home finances to do with your home. That's how I'm seeing it. But I feel it's all going to be well. Just be aware of people trying to be sneaky. Okay. So that's what is coming. That's what you need to be aware of. And Gemini, I hope this has been insightful for you. I'll leave the reading here. I'll see you next time or you will see me next time.